We got to know Lily through my wife's nephew, who went to college with Lily's father. And so when Lily was diagnosed with leukemia, uh, Steve, our nephew, mentioned Jeb, Lily's father, that, you know, basically my uncle works on leukemias, and they start reading about my work, and they find out that actually I discovered this translocation and the function of the gene that Lily has the leukemia with. Do you remember you had to take that yucky, all those yucky medicines? Yeah. And, yeah. and your tubies? Yeah, and then even that pineapple medicine, remember that? Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah totally. You didn't yeah. like that one. So I thought leukemia was just leukemia. There was, it is what it is. It's just like saying you have a cold, right? So I didn't know there was different types. I guess I never realized that how much goes in, like the research behind figuring out the genetic mutation of her bloodline. It's just, it's, it, it's blew me away. I have four kids, and you know, and I see pa parents that they come to our hospitals with their ill child, and you know, that, that hits you in the heart very hard, especially if you're a parent. You know, the last thing you want to see is you want to see your kid sick, you know, it's just very hard. And I think our interaction with Lily, our interaction with other patients really drives us to work 24-7 to come up with something that we can be helpful. So Samsung Corey Biomedical Research Center that has just been built has basically helped us to take our science and Northwestern medicine science to the next level. If we can come up with a drug that kids saves kids like Lily and others, you know, it would be fantastic. Dad, Hi. Do you want to pet my elephant? Sure. Lily! She used to play this game because we have two like Nintendos that go to the TVs and they have punch out on it. She used to play it and then she one day she just said, I punched out cancer. I punched out cancer. I punched out cancer. I punched out cancer.